Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi was given a ceremonial welcome as he began his three-day China tour on Thursday. The visit is seen as a move to cement bilateral ties between the two Asian giants, often seen as being pitted against each other in the race for dominance in the region. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi was welcomed by Provincial Governor Lu Qinjian in Xi'an, the capital of Shaanxi. Prime Minister Modi also visited the Terracotta Warriors Museum in the city, which is also the hometown of Chinese President Xi Jinping. The Terracotta Army is a collection of sculptors depicting the armies of Xin Shi Huang, the first emperor of China. The Indian Prime Minister later visited Dakshinshan Buddhist Temple, where he interacted with the priests. Built in around 290 AD, it is one of the oldest Buddhist temples in the world. It is the place where Indian monks translated the Buddhist doctrine to Chinese. In one of the rarest instances of the Chinese leadership meeting a visiting country head outside Beijing, President Xi welcomed the Indian Prime Minister in Xi'an. The two sides also held a delegation-level meeting attended by both the country heads. Prime Minister Modi later left for capital Beijing for the second leg of his three-day visit. During his stay in the country, he is set to focus on balancing the bilateral trade, which is currently heavily in favor of China. Prime Minister Modi is also expected to take up the long-standing boundary issue with the political leadership in Beijing and make a push for more Chinese investment in India. And since China had been graduating from low technology to medium technology, and China had become the one of the major manufacturing centers in the world. So I think the visit is uh, quite obvious from this point of view to make the Make in India policy successful. Even though both countries express desire to strengthen bilateral ties, the frequent skirmishes at the border and the growing Chinese presence in Pakistan could unsettle the relations. Ahead of Prime Minister Modi's visit, India had summoned Chinese envoy to register its protest over the $46 billion China-Pakistan economic corridor which passes through Pakistan-occupied Kashmir.